It's the time of year colleges open up their doors to prospective students. Shaq Shackelford takes us to one of the country's renowned veterinary schools around town. From sugar gliders to alpacas, students at Oklahoma State University's Veterinarian School learn to take care of it all. For third year student Carolyn Dickinson, getting into the program was a dream come true. Well, I grew up in Oklahoma and my mom graduated from veterinary school here as well, so I kind of bleed orange anyway. Part of what makes OSU exemplary, their state-of-the-art equipment. There are 28 veterinarian schools around the country, but what makes Oklahoma State unique, they're one of just a handful that have an equine treadmill. These horses are hoofing it for their own health and their relatives. This is not just a workout, but the treadmill is used to diagnose medical problems and for research. There are only a set number of ways that you can evaluate different aspects of that horse's ability to exercise at peak performance, and this is one of them. That horse was talking a little bit ago, and I heard what it said. It wants some headphones. Students have to have a lot more than horse sense to get in. Only 82 of the nearly 1,000 applicants who apply are accepted. Set Your DVR, the premiere of CNBC's The Car Chasers, premieres tomorrow night and a local car auction company got in the fun. The cast visits the late car auction in its premiere episode. The guys that are selling the cars are trained in front of the camera, so they create a certain amount of excitement. The late car auction will be at the Tulsa Fairgrounds Expo Square June 7th through 9th. This is one of the top 10 auctions in the country. Over 700 vehicles will go on the auction block, including collector cars, trucks, motorcycles, and boats. So start saving your money so you can score a sweet new ride. For the list, I'm Shaq Shackelford.